On a sunny day in the small, bustling town of Sweetberry, there lived a young girl named Lily. Lily was known for her boundless energy, her love for all things sugary, and most notably, her lack of patience. More than anything in the world, Lily wanted to become the greatest baker Sweetberry had ever seen. However, her hurried ways often led her to overlook the most important ingredient in any recipe, dignity. One day, the town announced the event of the season, the Great Dignity Bake Off, a competition where the young bakers of Sweetberry were challenged not only to create their tastiest treats, but also to embrace and learn the value of dignity. The news set Lily's heart racing with excitement and dreams of victory. She was determined to win, but little did she know this contest would teach her something far more precious than any title. The competition was under the judicious eye of Miss Maple, a baker renowned not just for her delicious pastries, but for the grace and respect she showed towards everyone. She believed that baking was like life. What mattered most was doing things with care, love, and above all, dignity. As the contest began, Lily rushed through her baking, adding a pinch of this and a dash of that, all the while keeping a keen eye on her rivals. She mixed and whisked with all her might, wanting to be the first to present her masterpiece to Miss Maple. However, in her haste, Lily neglected to notice the mess she left behind, the ingredients wasted, and the troubled frowns of those around her. When at last, it was time for Miss Maple to taste her creation. Lily proudly presented her dish, a towering, splendid, albeit slightly wobbly cake. However, before Miss Maple could take a bite, she asked Lily to look around the room. For the first time, Lily saw the chaos she had caused, her friend's disapproving looks, and the disappointment in Miss Maple's eyes. Miss Maple, with a gentle smile, turned to Lily and said, My dear, to bake with dignity is to understand the value of patience, the importance of respect for those around us, and to recognize that our actions affect others. It's not the speed with which we complete our tasks or the eagerness to be first that defines our success, but the grace with which we carry ourselves and respect others in the process. That day, Lily didn't win the Great Dignity Bake Off. Yet, as she cleaned her mess, making amends with a heart full of newfound understanding, she felt a different kind of victory swelling in her chest. From that day forward, Lily approached her baking and life with a patient, respectful spirit, cherishing the dignified manner of conducting herself above all the speedy victories. And so, in the heart of Sweetbury, under the tender mentorship of Miss Maple, Lily found the true essence of victory. It wasn't in the ribbons or the trophies, but in the lessons of love, patience, and dignity that colored her life with the most delightful flavors. With each cake, cookie, and pie she baked, Lily spread the warm, sweet aroma of dignity throughout Sweetberry, inspiring all who knew her to embrace the gentle power of doing things not just quickly, but with the grace and respect that everyone deserves. The Great Dignity Bake Off was remembered not for its tasty treats, but for the invaluable lesson it taught. That dignity, much like the best ingredients, is essential in creating a life that's truly sweet.